Okay, what I'm about to show you is two sets of lights and they're called uh, Limo Studio lights is what I think they're called. And uh, lights like this are normally really expensive. I mean, we're talking in the thousand dollar range when you try to get lights that are like this. They really are. And they're big fluorescent lights inside a box, as you can see. And these lights came with their own stand. So I thought that was really, really cool. But the problem was they were horizontal. You couldn't stand them straight up and down like I have. And I had to buy additional hardware as you'll see here this particular bolt comes with it I put a uh, locking washer underneath it this is an L bracket here it comes down which I bought separately and then I bought um, I bought some bolts to put in here which is was already there actually the hole was there already so all I did was slide the bolt through it and, and connect it I mean I think the most expensive thing I did here was drilling the hole inside the bracket wi uh, wider because this bolt wouldn't go through. That was the only thing I did. I think the drill bit was like, I don't know, I think they charged me like $11 at my local hardware store. And uh, I picked up two of them. So one on each side, of course. And they, um, uh, they definitely make a huge difference on the um, on the green screen. The brighter I can get this green screen, the easier it is for me to chroma key it, I noticed. And with the lights off to the side, it just made things a whole lot easier when I put it in post to, um, to chroma key the uh, green screen. So if you're looking for a set of really big lights at really affordable prices, I mean, the lights themselves I think were like $80 and they came with the stand and everything. Now I had to buy the additional hardware, like I said, but you know, for the price compared to brand names, well, that's a home run right out of the park. I have the links in the bottom and uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one.